Hi guys, this is Jamie Pate. Welcome to this mini album process video. And today we're gonna to make a mini album, obviously. We are going to use the Art Walk 6x8 paper pad. I'm gonna show you how to do a back-to-back -back mini album binding. Uh, a lot of you guys probably have seen this before. Um, for those of you who haven't seen this before, let me just kind of give you a real quick explanation and then I'm gonna speed this up as I put it together. I'm just looking through here. Um, this six by eight pad is gonna be perfect for the mini pad I'm gonna make, the mini pad, the mini album I'm going to make because I'm just gonna fold this paper in half and my mini album is going to measure four by six. I'll show you what I need. So we're gonna go in here, our handy dandy scoring board. I'm just gonna to go to four inches right here. Just so I just wanna have a nice crisp fold. And so when you are making this kind of book, you do wanna make sure you have a nice fold on all your pages. Okay, so actually it's going to end up looking like this. And then you take another sheet, do the very same thing. Mm, let me see what I want here. So then when this is folded, exact same place at four inches, to, cause that's the halfway mark. Make a nice clean fold. Make sure all your sides are as even as they can be. Crease that, but we're gonna, remember we're gonna flip it over so that we're going to then next, and you'll watch me on the rest of these pages, we're going to adhere those two pages together and then continue on until our book is made. Let me speed this up so you can see what that looks like. is ready to go. And what's gonna happen next is I need a cover. So I like my covers to be a little stronger. So I have some handy dandy, yes, chipboard from a cereal box because firm believer in use what you have and make that work. What I'm gonna do is cover the front right up to the edges. You know, you could have a larger piece of paper and then come back over on the other side. This won't be seen. I've decided just to go ahead and just make my edges, and I'll have to trim some of that off. Make my paper go right up to the edges. And I think I'm gonna be pretty happy with that. So let's make the cover. So you saw that I made our tags and I used the 
Color Fresh Memory Planner reinforcement holes for the reinforcing the holes on them. And I'm going to put some twine in there. And they're all inside their pockets now and waiting to be embellished and for journaling to be added on there. I've added photos to each page. These are just about three by four and I like just the way they sat on the page. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to embellish pretty simply on this side. And I have um, sort of a friendship theme here that's going to be going throughout this book. And so that's what I'm going to do next. Okay, so I finished the tags and the embellishing inside. So let me just give you a real quick run through of how this finished up. Um, the front is done with these alpha stickers and a label from the 12, 6 by 12 sticker sheet. The Good Times is from the definition stickers. When you open it up, this cover page is kind of unique to itself. I have some tags hanging here and I stamped the date. And there is, of course, the tag that's inside and each of these pages has its own tag like that. After this page, I stuck to a formula. I had these friendship quotes and I'm kind of like rules, friend rules that I'd come across that I wanted to use. And so then when I created the tag, which I just stamped and then I used washi tape and then I journaled in there, I basically responded to the prompt or to the rule that I have on each page. So it's the same formula over and over again. The rule and some washi tape, photo, and a sticker. Same with that page. And these little half circles here, they're from these that I punched out when I was making pockets for the tag. So rule, little punch out, my tag, it's stamped, it has washi tape. So that's all the same on each of those. Just different stamp, different washi tape. Same with this, different washi tape, different sticker. And then we finish it up with this page. Look. Easy to make with a six by eight pad makes you a four by six little mini album and that you can decorate and embellish and add whatever you want to it. So thank you for watching.